Jed here to demonstrate how to set up and edit campaigns in Contact Center. Campaigns are also referred to as outbound call queues, allowing agents to return missed calls in a timely manner or reach out to customers with similar needs. Depending on your go-to plan, you may or may not have this option. To complete this task in the Go-To Desktop app or web experience, you must be an admin and have access to the Contact Center product. I'll be using the desktop app for this video, but GoTo can be accessed at this site. I've already signed in as the admin Ryan Noble, and this is a home screen. Take note of the left navigation panel. You may see different icons here, depending on what options are available with your GoTo plan. Let's add a new campaign. Click the contact center icon. If you do not see it, like in my case, click the more icon and then click Contact Center. Select Campaigns. If you've previously created a campaign, you will see that here. Click the Add Campaign button. Begin by giving the campaign a name. From the Type drop-down list, Choose either Basic or Intelligent Call Routing. When choosing Intelligent Call Routing, you will need to add it to your dial plan later and verify that the skills have been assigned to this campaign's agents. Be sure to click Save once you're done. Our new campaign opens and we can now configure it. The Overview tab reflects the information we just entered. That can be updated or changed by clicking the Edit button. Settings types are organized by General, Agent, Caller, and Recording from the Settings section. I won't go over these settings in this video, but I highly encourage you to read through this list. There is a description below each one to help provide clarification. The Supervisors and Agent sections are similar. From here, you can see who has been assigned to that role. Let's begin by assigning a supervisor. Click the Assign Supervisors button. It should be noted that you can assign more than one supervisor if needed. To assign a user as a supervisor, search for one of your users or click on their name that you see here, and then click the Assign button. Click the X in the Unassigned column if you need to remove them from this list. Click on the Agents button. Agents can be added to this campaign in the same fashion as supervisors. The Logged In Users column is for informational purposes. As you probably guessed from the title, this allows you to see what users are currently logged into the queue. Since I just created this campaign, no users will display at this point. Now that you've successfully created a new campaign, you'll want to ensure that your supervisors know how to manage this feature in the supervisors dashboard and that your agents know how to handle these dispatched calls. That's all there is to set up and edit campaigns in Contact Center for GoTo.